it's time to dye some Easter eggs. Another cool thing that we're doing with our egg dyeing today is that we are using Kool-Aid for the dye. Picked up a whole bunch of Kool-Aid packets. Alright guys, so here is our Kool-Aid egg setup. I put about half a cup to two-thirds cup of water. I think you can get away with half a cup and the less water the better because it's more concentrated. You have to kind of experiment with the colors because you never know what's going to be at the store because they have like 40,000 different flavors of Kool-Aid. The ones that worked out best for us were peach mango, which I'd never even knew existed, lemon lime, strawberry, cherry. I'm trying to do a purplish, bluish color here, but I don't think it's working. There was no blue Kool-Aid at our Walmart by our house, so we just have to try to make do. So I did <coughs> cheat a little bit. I added just some regular food coloring to the peach mango because I was worried that it wasn't going to be yellow enough. And then what I did for this was I mixed uh, fruit punch with a little bit of blue food coloring hoping to get a purple. And I tried, I dumped this out and tried it over and over again multiple times and I don't think it's going to come out exactly the way I want. It's super easy and it doesn't require any vinegar because there's citric acid in Kool-Aid which starts to kind of dissolve the shell and allows it to absorb colors. So these have been sitting for about 10 or 15 minutes. And we'll see how they came out. So here's peach mango. That didn't come out too bad, but that's nice. It comes out nice and bright. So here's our lemon lime. That one came out great. This is strawberry. I was hoping for more pink. Came out kind of red. Cherry came out looking a whole lot like strawberry. So I'm gonna have to lighten that up for our next batch. Here's my purple. <laughs> Which came out of brownish, blackish green. Not the best one. Come on. Gotta finish dying Easter eggs. Alrighty guys, we're finishing up our eggs here. Wait, two more after this. Two more, alright. Peach mango. Green. The green ones are coming out nice. Yeah. What flavor is that? Lemon lime. Lemon lime. And I added yellow food coloring to this one. one because this is what it was last time. It didn't make much of a difference. Oh no, it sure didn't. Cherry. Cherry, cherry. Blue the blue. Much better. We got the blue the blue. So we cheated and we resorted to all food coloring on that one. On the, oh, okay. Is that why there's only one? Yeah, but I'm going to do another one right now. Even though we're not Kool Aid drinkers, I have to tell you, this is the most delicious smelling egg dye that I've ever made. <laughs> it smells so true, fruity true. and delicious. Yeah. Are you having fun dyeing your eggs? Did you show everybody your new shirt with the little bunnies on it? Oh, yeah, yeah. What's this? What's that? <laughs> That's a not bunny. a bunny. That's a bunny. So we got some eggs. So where we're going next. Where's everybody going? It's a Saturday before Easter have to dye their eggs. You tell them. Oh, buddy. We have a big problem in our yard if the flea medicine can't help. Hit... No, there's a big spider.